Hey Wingman, Military Installation Review, Part 3. Let's end it. Marine Corps Base Quantico, located near Triangle, Virginia. Yo, this place is pretty safe. Marine Corps OCS is here, so you better be on your P's and Q's. As a matter of fact, the most dangerous thing out here is a six-year-old with a knife hand. But this place is pretty beautiful though. There's a lot of trees, but you don't know if it's a tree or a Marine, so just drive slow. But if you love the Marine Corps, history, and hating on the Navy, you're about to get to Quantico, bruh. Seymour Johnson Air Force Base, located near Goldsboro, North Carolina. If you ain't never been in the Shady J, you have no idea what they do there. All you see is a bunch of officers and a lot of tiny buildings. As a matter of fact, if you got 58 cents, you can buy out the commissary. And off base ain't all that good either. You better take yourself something before you get out to the Gold's Ghetto. But there's a lot of good stuff too if you want to drive to it. But the way the gas prices is now, I'd rather just stay on base. But if you like mountains, the ocean, and mop gear, you need to get to the Shady J. Naval Air Station Pensacola, located in the Panhandle of Florida. I ain't never seen a gate that big. Why you need 58 lanes in order to get on base? Plus also, this is a training base, so this is where young sailors and young Marines learn how to get in trouble. The ones that graduate are the ones that got away with it. I mean, it is a pretty cool place, though. I mean, it is the home of the Blue Angels. So if you like running, the rain, and all-out debauchery, you need to get to the Peak Cola. And if you like what I'm doing, like, share, and comment. Have peace and love.